high of Gage, and this is the We Are The High Flyers and after the success of our last two singles we are now back with our brand new album which is called Born Desi and the reason why we called it Born Desi was because we think it represents our roots and our style of music. Track 1 on the album is the Manic Tribute and it features the powerful vocals of Badrid Khan who is the nephew of Gulit Manik. We feel this is a standout track on the album. Initially, what we wanted to do with this track is do a collaboration between Gulit Manik and his son Yudvi Manik, but he sadly passed away. Um, but to keep that authenticity, we used Badrid Khan on the vocals. This song is basically a mixture of Gulit Manik's classic tunes, and we hope you like it. Surt de gaya khir di Track 2, Arjun, was the first single from his album. It features the vocals of Just One Hero and it's quite a uplifting and catchy track. and it features the vocals of Billa Furozpuriya, brilliant vocalist and he was actually the winner of Voice of Punjab 3 competition on BTC Punjabi. <laughs> It was the second single from this album, uh, which came out last year. It featured the powerful vocals of the legend Kaka Peniwala. Uh, we've been told that this track was the perfect track for training at the gym. And the agreement for this track was actually done the week before Kaka Peniwala passed away. So this track doesn't mean a lot to it personally. <laughs> Track number five is called Din Koshianda and it features the powerful vocals of Bakshi Villa who never disappoints. The lyrics and the music for this song are designed specifically for weddings and celebrations, so we hope you like it. <laughs> Track number six. Now every album needs a love track, and this one is called Pyar Tere Naal. It features the vocals of Just One Hira, and this is the romantic love song for this album. So track number seven, this is called Gulliver Cree. In other words, Gulliver Cree meaning hug. Um, this is one of the biggest tracks on our album and it's a duet between the legendary Kaka Peniwala and a great female vocalist called Jyoti Gyo. Um, this song features a very, very powerful doll and it's got a great Bhangra beat designed for the dance floor. 
Um, the vocals for this song were given to us after Kaka Beniwala passed away um, because the people behind the song wanted us to get the full potential out of it and we hope you enjoy the song when you listen to it. Track number 8 is called Love I'm Seen in London. It features the vocals of Major Janalia, who we worked with on a previous album. And the track is actually a tribute to Shaheed Udham Singh. And this song tells a story of part of his life in London. <laughs> Track number 9, this is called Full Speed and it features a very very strong hip hop beat. Once again it features the vocals of Just One Peter and a great rapper called Demonic. It's totally different to anything we have done before and it's designed to be played in cars. Um, it's quite a catchy tune and we hope you like the song. Track number 10 is a remix of a previous song called Shera Vange. Instead of the original Desi version, we decided to go with a hard hitting hip hop beat. Track 11 is a remix of a track from our previous album, it's called Yar Himesha. Um, this is one of our favourite tracks of our last album and it features the vocals of Bakshi Villa. Uh, this song is about true friends. <laughs> Okay, track number 12 is a remix of a track called Golobi Suit, which we released on our first album. The track was really popular, so we decided to do a more reggae style beat rather than the original Desi version. <laughs> Right, track 13 and 14 are both instrumentals, one of our own and the other of um, full speed. Right, the album will be released on Thursday 10th of April on VIP Records and it will be accompanied with a video to the Monarch Tribute which was shot mainly in Punjab, partly on the well-known GT Road, so we hope you like it. Right guys, don't forget to check out our website yeah, www.highflyersmusic.co.uk and don't forget to follow us on Facebook and Twitter at Highflyers Music. Right, we'd love to say a big thank you to VIP Records and also a big thank you to everyone who has supported us through uh, the last three years of working on this album and also everyone who's been buying the music. If you like the music, please make sure you buy the original. Mm.